I really do like Lydia. She's such a laugh. Yeah, I guess. Hmm. What's that mean? Nothing. It's just I barely remember her. It was years ago. She is way too good for you anyway. Oh, you think so? Mm. Maybe. All I'm saying is I'm pretty happy with what I ended up with. Oh. <laughs> uh, hang on a minute. We need to sort out this uh, joint Christmas. Uh, yeah, maybe we should just text everybody. You was? Yeah. Well, if we text everyone, we'll just ignore it. We need to cajole them into thinking it's a good idea. Do you think it's a good idea? It could be a bloodbath. Yeah, but it's that or we spend Christmas apart. <sighs> OK, OK, fine. Let me get some work done and I'll get my cajoling hat on. And what does the cajoling hat look like? Uh, red with the bobble on. Mm. See you later, my dear. The once in Royal David City. Oh, don't. Daniel's going to hate my family. I mean, there's just no way we're going to be able to do a joint Christmas. Ah, <sighs> well, maybe it's not meant to be. Right, so you're just going to, you're going to shrug your shoulders and give up? Well, we've tried everything. Well, you might be ready to give up, but I'm not. You, and you, with me now. What for? Because I said so. <laughs> I'd listen to her if I were you. Hey, sorry, I've got a minute. What are they doing? Right, all of you, can you just shut up for a minute? Right, one way or another, we're going to have to learn to get on with each other. Says who? Says me. And why should we listen to you? Because in nine months' time, I might be the mum of a little niece or nephew. You're pregnant? Uh, let's just say it's a work in progress. Oof. Yeah, well, let's uh, hope you make better parents than he has. Oh, says the father of the local drug dealer. Do you know what? It's even more pathetic than you lot squabbling. It's me thinking a baby might change things. I thought just for once we could all get together for Christmas as a family. But no, we're going to stand here and rip chunks out of each other, aren't we? Honestly, I don't know why I even bother. Have you been making no, babies no. with him? No, don't be stupid. I'm not that desperate. Yeah, all right, yes, I was, but it's just because we've got to do it as often as possible. And... All right, save me the gory details, thank you. Imran used to do it all the time at Toya. Really? What, on the desk? Can we just, please, I've only come round just to say Max has apologised for his little bit of fun that he had at the Christmas. Little bit of fun? All right, he's irresponsible behaviour, all right? Apparently, Daniel put in a good word for him at school. Ooh, that's good. That's something, isn't it? Yeah, so I've just come to say, if the offer's still on the table about Christmas Day, then Team Platt is officially green for go. Well, luckily for you, it is. Well, I spoke to Daniel, and the rest of the Barlows are on board too, so I guess that makes us officially quarried. Officially? Stuck with each other. Ah, right. Well, no doubt you'll be sticking that down on the old Scrabble board come Christmas Day. Would it kill you to just be a bit more positive? I'm being realistic, that's all. Sarah, me, you and Nick, we gave Mum an heart attack, didn't we? We were arguing that much. With this lot coming round Boxing Day, she'd be probably dead. You're flying low, by the way. We just made the worst decision of our lives. What? Trying to get pregnant? Making our family spend Christmas together. No. No. Hmm. Maybe.